Hello, and welcome to Peace Corps' Tips and Tricks for English Teachers. Today we're going to talk about setting clear lesson objectives. Now there are lots of ways to approach this topic, but I've asked Annie to talk about SMART objectives, a popular format that she likes to use. So Annie, tell us about setting SMART objectives. I always follow the SMART format when setting lesson objectives. SMART is an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Realistic and Time-bound. In my language lessons, the objectives describe how the students will learn or demonstrate their mastery of the lesson by reading, speaking, writing and listening. The more specific my objectives, the more I know how to build my lessons and the better my students know what is expected of them. For example, by the end of the lesson, the students will be able to name 10 common fruits and vegetables. And when an objective is measurable, it means I'm able to assess whether or not the students have mastered the task. So what about achievable and realistic? Are they basically the same thing? Well, when setting achievable objectives, I always have my students' profile in mind. Their learning needs, interests, previous language experience, language proficiency level. If my lesson objective for my middle school student is that they write an essay for on the grocery store, this is not an achievable ob objective, since essay writing is something that is covered in high school. But even for high school students, essay writing is not a realistic, since a typical English class is only 45 minutes long. So no, they are two different things. So how do you make your objectives time-bound? A time-bound objective sets a clear deadline by which the result must be achieved. For every time, I set a clear time, which is the end of the lesson. When I write the objectives, I start with by the end of the lesson, and then I have a good sense of what can be accomplished in the time I have. As you can see, SMART objectives help you design an effective and achievable lesson that fits your learner's profile and your time limits. Do you use SMART objectives or have another favorite strategy for setting lesson goals? We'd love to hear. Drop us a line at tipsandtricks.am at peacecore.gov.